First and foremost, we don't do this for us. We do it for you. If you don't already know what you want to be great in, or great at, spend your middle school years or your high school years trying to figure it out. The only way to figure it out is trying to experience as much as possible. Do new things. See if it's something that you love or you hate. Once you get into high school and out, you'll have an opportunity to be just as great at whatever you choose to do as Leon is as a basketball player and now is as a speaker, as Lucky is as a mascot, as your principal is or your teachers are and what they do every day. If you take anything away from Leon, commit yourself to being great. School, you all have a brand new technology lab to learn and to be able to help you achieve your dreams and your goals. Do it up yourself. And you heard me talk about some of our friends, some of our friends, particularly at Southern New Hampshire University. Um, they are extremely committed. To you all, even though you don't know them. About three years ago, the beginning of our friendship and partnership, we said, what can we do together to give back to the community? And they started talking about how one of the goals and one of the important parts of the mission of SNHU was to be able to provide access to an amazing college education. And that was one of the biggest priorities for SNHU. And so I said to, to some folks back then, you need access to technology in order to get an education. And so let's work together to try to provide schools that may not have access to technology, access to these amazing tools, cutting edge innovative tools, to be able to help them investigate what they may be most passionate about. We at Southern New Hampshire University are serious about providing access to education, uh, not only for higher ed, but for all ages. And that's why this is important to us. The Celtics, it's, it's where service isn't a punchline, and they're serious about it, and, and that's, that's, that's why we like doing projects. All these folks are in middle school. There's a long road ahead. Someday they're going to be able to realize their dreams. What are some of the things that they need to do on a daily basis that you still do on a daily basis to be able to leave success? as something that is feasible down the road. Yeah, I think uh, you know, every day I wake up, I just try to become a better my craft as a bas uh, basketball player. Uh, Scott's a police officer. He says I'm uh, not all as talented as I am, but I can never do what he does. Uh, um, you know, it really depends on what you want your craft to be. You really just got to push yourself to be better at it every day. You got to work at it. Sometimes it's difficult. Uh, sometimes it's uh, tough. But in the end, it's always gratifying best foot forward uh, and you really spend the time trying to be the best player that you can be and then hopefully you can be successful that way. It's awesome you know, being able to, like I said, if, if I can help one kid uh, hopefully you know, find a passion or be successful in life, but, uh, I feel like I'm doing my job. And, you know, I've obviously been given a great platform and been very blessed. Uh, if I can help some kid somewhere, that's really all I'm trying to do.